If you want to see your GPU usage within Task Manager and have it here listed so you can see which application is using the most of your graphics card and find out if there's any problems at a glance, I'm going to show you how to do that because as default, you'll find that it doesn't show this, but it is really easy to add in. As standard, when you hit Control Shift Escape on your keyboard to open up Task Manager, or alternatively right click on the taskbar and click on Task Manager, you'll see that Task Manager launch is looking something like this, with CPU, memory, disk, and network usage in place here. You'll see there's space for additional columns here, but no easy way to add them. You'd think it would be under Options, for example, but it isn't. The way to do it is to go to the Status section, right click, and then click GPU you'll see that the GPU has now appeared in here and we can see how much it's getting used in total and then which of the apps is using it most. If you want to, you can also add in other things like power usage, for example. Some other tips while we're here for Task Manager, one thing that's worth knowing if you don't know already is that the Startup Apps section here is worth looking at because with this, you can disable things that you don't want to launch as standard when you enable Windows and when you log on. So when your PC first boots, so it's worth disabling stuff that you're not going to use immediately and therefore make your Windows boot happen more swiftly. Also, you'll notice that my task manager is dark and that's because I'm using dark mode in Windows. In order to do that, you need an active account for Windows and an activation license, but then you just search for dark mode settings. And in there, you'll find from this drop down that you can select dark or light mode. Dark will then apply to everything including Task Manager. Hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching.